Und ah, ich muss ja. Du musst ja. And again, we are back with the craziest aviation facts you didn't know but can't live without episode number uh, 2437 already. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's, it's, it's 13 or 14. Um, anyways, as always, introduction, you go first. I go first. So, um, we all know that uh, flights can be pretty exhausting and yeah. stressful. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> Depends on several factors. Depends on that, yeah. several, several facts. Um, but yeah, an average flight, let's mm -hmm. say an average three hour flight mm -hmm. nowadays. Mm -hmm. What do you think? How many liters of water does your body lose in a plane on a three hour flight in aver on average? <laughs> You're just sitting around. You don't. You you you're not exercising or anything. Did you, did you lose any weight? You're, I'm, not I'm not sweating. I'm, I'm, I'm always you're freezing not, actually. But you're not feeling because the air is so dry. You know that's that's one part of it. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Let's go for. I have no 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 clue at all. Um, three three liters. Half of it. Like 1.5. 1.5. But imagine, like, as you said, you, you never feel really nah, sweaty on a plane, and especially on a three hour flight. I'm always freezing. As I say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you freeze, but still lose. But still lose a lot of yeah. but Maybe that's the reason why you should drink a lot. Exactly. Beer, Keep that up. Beer, wine. <laughs> beer, wine. <laughs> Everything else they offer. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that could make a flight less stressful, at least for you. <laughs> Definitely, only for me. Only for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, so I go again today for plane crashes. Again. <laughs> <laughs> I think I talked about plane crashes again. Um, I think we, we all know that um, the majority of crashes happen during takeoff and landing. Yeah. I think it's within the first five minutes and, and then yeah. the, the, the last five minutes. But what do you think? Um, What's actually the percentage, when you take a look at all mm -hmm. plane crashes ever happen, what's the percentage of crashes happens during takeoff and landing? Okay, because we talked about that before, that excludes crashes that happen like before and like on, I'm, on ground, like where you're where they're actually I, on I, ground. I think so, it's really okay, just a uh, taxing, takeoff and uh, taxing okay, and, okay, and, okay, and okay. Uh, on block. As he said, when you think back, there are not a lot of crashes happening like mid-air. Something going wrong at the start, catching a catching a dog, a chicken, <laughs> chicken cut, <laughs> <a> chicken cut, <laughs> something something like that. Um, I would go with eighty percent. Wow! Is it correct? Yes! For the first time ever. Finally. We made it! We are! It's 80%. It's 80%. Yep, 80% of uh, all plane crashes have crazy. Take off and landing. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> wow! Okay! So, so I basically already won the round. Yeah. There we go. No vote this time. No, they don't need your votes right today. Um, it's Robin's round. Thank you very much. Cool. Thank you for watching. There's gonna be a vote for the next episode. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. <laughs>